Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. So it's going to be an another informative video for small businesses. So in today's video, I'll I will tell you about uh, some of the features of BM2Y application. So let's get started. The first thing that we are going to see is how to list your products on the BM2Y application. So you have successfully logged in into the application. It will show something like this. So here you get the option of add your first product. Tap on it. Now you can choose the product you want to list on the website. Here you can add the product name, its price, its MRP. MRP is the actual price of the product and on the price you will uh, add the amount at which you are offering the product to the customer. Then available stock, then if any other product detail you want to add, you can add it here. So once you have filled all the details, it will be done and it's going to show something like this. Now you can add more products by tapping on this icon. Again, it's the same procedure you will need to follow. Fill all the details. Next, it will show something like this. So, I hope this function is clear. Okay, so now we will move on to the next feature. That is, how can we offer uh, different options to our customers? For example, if you have uh, two or more color options in some product, then how people can choose which one they want from the website. So here as we can see in this keychain we have two color options one is green and the second one is pink so here we will go on manage variation option add you can add your variant name next here we have variant price and after that we can add the variant stock we entered all the information just update it now we have both of the options go back let's check it on the website here you can see that on the website people get two options from which they can choose okay now we'll go back to the application now let's move on to the next function that is how to create product categories on the website for example you are offering various products to the people like bag charms earrings bracelets so in that case you can create different categories for each product um, for instance if a person wants to buy a bracelet then they won't have to go throughout the whole website and they can just go uh, on the bracelet section and check out all the options that are available so here you need to tap on the collections next here you can add your first collection just add the name we are going with the keychain first so here one category is made of keychain then we can add a new collection so you can make as many as collections you want now we will go back to the product section and here you see this icon just tap on it here you will see all the collections as it is a keychain i will add it under keychain similarly you can add multiple products in a section it's done so it is really easy and i hope this is clear so the last function that we are going to see today is how to add discount codes on the website so just in case if you are going to offer a sale to your customers then you can add the discount code on the website and then share the same with your customers this we will go on to the settings then here we have discount codes tap on it next you can add here code name discount value and minimum cart value if you want to add as you can see here i have added diwali as the discount code name and 15 as the discount value so if you want to give like 10 15 or 20 percent off on the total order value you can go for 15 uh, you can go with the discount value that is 10 15 20 50 whatever you want along with the percentage option and if you want to give flat 50 rupees or 100 rupees off then you can just add that so here it is done show like this and you can go back to your product section again so that's it for today's video i hope this information will be helpful for you and just in case if you have any doubt just leave it in the comment section i'll try to help out as much as i can